Okay, here's a video of my Kubota four-cylinder diesel motor that I took out of a carrier reefer unit of a refrigeration truck. I just finished it up, pulled it outside today and I'm warming it up. Uh, warm the oil up and want to drain it and change the oil. It still has old oil in it from when I purchased it. There's the radiator down underneath here. And my safety gauges. And my control switches. They're kind of hidden underneath that plastic radiator shroud. I had to mount the air filter. It was mounted up high vertically. Over here it's got a full flow oil filter. And then there's a bypass oil filter right there. And then to the left of that is the fuel filter. I'm hoping it burns about a quart an hour of diesel fuel. We'll find out. That's an output shaft I had a machine shop made for me. Pulled it onto the flywheel and I got a power takeoff shaft that's going to plug into there and that's going to drive the hydraulic pump that's going to drive the pivot. I had to mount the alternator. It was mounted totally different away above the motor driven by belts with gear cases. So I got it mounted on the side. All right, we'll start it up here. You can listen to it run. Let's reach down here. I got start and glow plug. Gotta press this button in, hold it in. Doesn't help here, it's off and on, so we'll flip it up. Above that is a switch, electric idle and, and fast idle. I got a wire to the solenoids. I need the MCATs around there. Alright, we'll fire that baby up.